Hello to you from Milan, a city synonymous with high fashion. The stadium might not be fashionable anymore, but it remains iconic, the San Siro. Derek Ray here on the commentary box, joined as always by former England defender Lee Dixon. And this is where it all starts in the UEFA Champions League. The group stage and match day one, my goodness, so much to look forward to. It's Inter versus Barcelona. Well, the first group stage of the Champions League is always exciting. Three points is vital for both teams to get off to a good start. Or a draw may be a good result as well. We're about to find out what happens. Pinto's lineup is as follows. Samir Handanovic begins in goal. Milan Skriniar plays with Diego Godin at the back. Marcelo Brozovic plays alongside Matias Vecino in the centre of midfield. And the tactical configuration has two players in attack from the very outset. Well, in Catalan, they say, mesh que un club, more than a club. And this has always been more than just any old competition for Barcelona, Lee. Well, it's almost their own. They just love playing in this competition. We always get good games when Barcelona turn up. And I don't think we're in for anything other than that in the group stages. They'll be concentrated because they're professionals. And that'll probably get them through to the knockout stages. And then we know what happens from there. And the Barcelona shape looks like this. Marc-Andre Ter Stegen starts in goal. Jordi Alba plays with Nelson Semedo in the wide defensive areas. And the defenders had better be on their toes because leading the line is Luis Suarez. It's the opening match day. Champions League group stage match day one underway. Now Brozovic. Skriniar. Brozovic. And Poli running towards goal. Keeper did his job to begin with. So a throw in here. Lazaro. That's an effective cross aimed at the back post. Lionel Messi. Arthur has it. Always difficult to predict in advance who might decide a game, but you could make a strong case for this man. Lee, what are you anticipating seeing from him? Well, yeah, when defenders look who they're playing against, they always look at the goals. Two goals in his last previous game. He's certainly a threat to them today. Nelson Semedo. Barcelona moving the ball swiftly and finding themselves in a promising position. Well, sometimes there's no great mystery in terms of a team's preferred. Excellent vision. He's managed to get in behind. Well, he saw the whites of the keeper's eyes and the whites of his outstretched gloves. Great goalkeeping. Well, he's denied a certain goal there. Great reflexes from the keeper. Over it comes. It was well stopped. Well, the positioning is everything for a goalkeeper, and he was in a good position then. Messi. Nelson Tomato has it. Sergio Busquets. Suarez. Might be able to get in by Suarez! And a goal it is, the opener in this game. Well, keep it tight, that's what both managers would have been saying. But now the opening goal's gone in. Tactics have got to change. Well, let's see that one again. It's all about the contact, does everything right. He's not bothered where the goal is. He knows where it is. He gets a beautiful strike on it. Well, let's take another look at that goal, shall we?
underway again with Barcelona in the lead. A very attractive looking move, easy on the eye, but nothing there. Jordi Alba. De Jong. Messi. And Lionel Messi giving it away, not really like him. Barella has it. And a throw in it's going to be. Now Griezmann. Griezmann. Far from a good pass. A real opening now. Big chance it is. And a goal. The equaliser. Superb entertainment. Well, Derek, as we see here, this is why I wasn't a forward. He passes this ball into net, uses all that finesse he's got. I just didn't have it. I'd have put my laces straight through that ball, but what a finish. Even Steven won a piece on this match. Artur. Now Busquets. Frankie de Jong. Working away patiently, looking for an opening. Good tackle. And they're trying to get right into his face. Giving the ball away. It's an excellent looking attack, courtesy of Griezmann here. Now Jordi Alba. Well, Barcelona have had total control of possession, but that doesn't lead to goals necessarily. They haven't created enough. Too slow up front, midfield, very average. The coach, he's not happy at all. He wants more from this team. And that's an important intervention. Slipshot passing. Magnificent read, fine tackle, Stefan de Frey. Running with the ball confidently. De Jong. Jordi Alba. And possession lost, intercepted. No getting past Jodine. Oh, goodness, he was right on top of the situation to get the ball back for his team. Ball lost by Inter. Looking confident with the ball at his feet. But he has just veered into an offside position this time. Really a very poor ball. That is that for the first half here. You've certainly got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Lee. Well, he's been involved in most of the positive things in that first half, and obviously getting that goal has given his team a huge boost for this second half.
And so the second half of this Champions League group stage match day one contest commences. Artur, De Jong. Now Jordi Alba. Godin. Bonitano. Still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead. Given away. Not what he was intending. Bad pass. Breaking at pace. Jordi Alba. De Jong. Now Griezmann. Just drifted into the illegal position. Offside, in the opinion of the officials. Substitution time it is. Vecino on the ball. Pantaro. Martinez. Using all his defensive acumen to cut it out. Messi. Nelson Tomato has it. This is Vidal. Messi into the advanced position. Well, that's not watertight defending. Can he give them the lead? And the finishing touch applied for Barcelona. Genius. It really is genius. What a finish. Well, I'm sure you want to see this again. Where is everybody? The defenders, nowhere to be seen. It's an open goal. And we'll find out a lot about Inter's attitude in the aftermath of that concession. Half an hour remaining then. Godin. Vecino. Martinez. And the defender finding a solution to the problem. Vecino on the ball. Martinez. And now Politano. So following the deflection, a corner kick coming up here. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. He's driven in the corner. Cleared away comprehensively. Now Busquets. Lionel Messi. This is Vidal. Nelson Tomato has it. And as a defender, you really have to concentrate to the maximum to... Griezmann! Giving the ball away one moment and then making a fine save the next. Yeah, we all make mistakes, don't we, Derek? On that occasion, it was the goalkeeper, but he made up for it. Maneuvering forward is Griezmann. And space for the cross. Rakitic... It could be. And that's some goalkeeping to hang on to the shot like that. Rakitic on the ball. Griezmann hanging on to the ball in this fashion suits them. An important interception. Vidal, Messi. Suarez!
A corner courtesy of Lionel Messi. Well, not quite. Rakitic. Will he play it in? Rakitic on the ball. Well, there are the stats, Derek. Barca controlling possession over the last 15 minutes. And if you look at how they played, they deserve another goal. And if they were to get one, that would surely put the game to bed. Ten minutes left for play in this match. Threaded through by Lukaku. Martinez! And he's made it a brace for himself. The defender's just unable to stay with him. And he's having a field day. Well, here it is again. You're trained from a young age to get in those sort of positions. I'm never in any real doubt he'd finish that. Cool and composed. Well, another equaliser. What a topsy-turvy game this has been. Five minutes remaining and level pegging here. Ivan Rakitic. An abundance of space. Jordi Alba. Sergio Busquets. Rakitic on the ball. Jordi Alba. Rakitic. Fine, fine margins. Offside, but only just in this tight game. Well, the game right there, Derek. The game right there. Jordi Alba. Suarez. Now Jordi Alba. We've been waiting to find out, now we know, a minimum of three added minutes here. Ivan Rakitic. Barcelona on the attack in the closing moments. Still level here. Romelu Lukaku now. Quick thinking to dispossess his opponent. And there's the whistle. They cannot be separated after 90 minutes.